Hi everyone, I hope you're as ready for a very cozy H&M haul as I am. It's absolutely freezing outside. So I have lots of gorgeous pieces to share with you in today's video. All of them will be linked in the description box down below and I'll include all the sizes that I picked everything up in. I also have a couple items I just remembered from Abercrombie, which I think you'll love as well. And they have a great sale going on. You can get, I think 20% off site wise. So I'll have the details in the description box as well. Subscribe and turn that notification bell on if you haven't already. And let's just jump straight into it. One of my absolute favorite things to wear this time of year is a sweater dress. And H&M does them so well. They come out with different styles and variations year after year. This one is so timeless and classic. I love the neutral color of it. It's very easy to style. It has that kind of like quintessential cable net detailing that we typically see in the winter time, which I love. It's carried down the sleeves. It's not itchy at all, which I think is really important. It also comes to a nice length, so it's not too short. And I find sweater dresses are surprisingly really easy to style. They can elevate your outfit, but they're gonna keep you cozy and warm at the same time. So I actually find myself reaching for them quite a bit to wear to my part-time job at the bank. They're dressy, I pop them on with tights and typically knee-high boots and a really cute wool coat. You can elevate them and dress them up in the evening. I have a few in my suitcase at the moment that I'm bringing on an upcoming trip. This is another really gorgeous option from H&M, but very different from the previous one I've shared with you. So it has that V-neck style, which is really cute for like throwing your jewelry on over top. Nice and fitted through the arms. It's very, very soft. This one is not gonna be itchy on the body at all. And it is in a midi length. So it's kind of like walking around with a very elegant blanket draped down across your body. I personally would just style this probably with tights and either ankle or knee high boots. You could easily get a long sleeve shirt on over top. You could even go with leggings on underneath and then your boots and nobody's gonna even know that you're wearing pretty much a full outfit on underneath. And I do believe this one did come in a few different color options. Now is also the time to stock up on sweaters and knits because come January, we're gonna start seeing swimwear on the racks and wow, it's way too early for that. But now's the time to grab your sweaters. So this one caught my attention on H&M's website, mostly because of the color. I think it's absolutely gorgeous and it's really unlike anything I have in my wardrobe. Really into brown this season, can you tell? But this one I thought was really beautiful and eye-catching and could be dressed up or down. I love the cable knit detailing on it. It really screams winter to me. It kind of has a nice relaxed fit so you can layer up underneath it, a gorgeous zipper at the front. But now what I didn't take note of when I was ordering this online is that it contains 50% wool. Yes, 50%. And I'm, well, I'm allergic to wool. I have a very strong wool sensitivity and I like to stay under 5%, but here we are. My friend said he didn't feel like it felt itchy. He thought it felt quite soft. So maybe he's not allergic to wool. I'm gonna give it a go. I haven't tried it on yet. I'm thinking if I just layer up underneath, I should be good. My son is here. He's wanting all mommy's attention. He doesn't really like being picked up. But we're gonna show you him. Hi, beautiful. You're watching the people outside. You're gonna let mommy film? Okay, bye. <laughs> this next piece is more of a casual option. I think this one would be great to wear, you know, on weekends, thrown over top of leggings. You could style it with jeans. Really cute to wear on those chillier days for, you know, dog walks or cat walks, like this crazy cat mummy over here. I love the color of it. Initially, I wasn't too sure, but I put it on. I was like, no, this is super cute. And what we're seeing a lot this season are these kind of Sherpa fleece jackets with nylon kind of material incorporated into them, which I think is really cool. It's all about adding kind of textures and those element of interest into your outfits this time of year. This one has a hood on the back. It's not detachable. Typically, I like to be able to remove my hood, but it's been so chilly and windy here this year that I think that this is a really great option. It also also comes to a nice length so I think it looks cute over top of leggings it has a zip closure a pocket right here which you could actually put some cash your cards your keys or probably even your phone in there moving in to coats and jackets this next one is from H&M and I put it on just so you can kind of see what it looks like as I'm talking about it because to be honest I really love the color of it it's extremely soft and cozy but I feel like it's just a little bit too much on me. I'm quite petite. I'm five foot three, a hundred pounds. And I really feel like this jacket just kind of overpowers me a little bit though. I mean, I love the look of it. I just think this front area is a bit more than I can handle. It's kind of like wearing 
a kind of like dressier, cozy robe that's like appropriate to wear out of the house. You can easily layer up underneath it. It does have a snap closure at the front here, but like, I don't even know where it snaps. I can't find it, but you can kind of see that even if I turn around, it's a bit kind of bulky. So for that reason, although it was a great price, I don't think I'll be hanging onto this one. If you live in an extremely cold climate, you might actually really, really love this. But the next one I have to share with you is from Abercrombie and you'll see kind of what I mean when comparing the two. So this next one is from Abercrombie. I don't necessarily know that I would wear it over top of the sweater dress that I have on. I have a white one from Zara, it's in my suitcase at the moment, and I feel like this or over top of a black one, or even kind of like a light kind of camel beige color would look really nice, but this is kind of what I mean. Now this one is not nearly as long as this one is from H&M, but it's also not as thick and bulky, but gives off kind of the same look and feel. You know what this kind of material reminds me of? Those like really cute, like, what are they called? Teddy bearer, like teacup poodle style dogs. I feel like if I were to get a dog, I'd totally get one of those, especially in this color. They're so freaking cute, but I love the shade of this. I think it's really beautiful. It's great for fall and winter, but you can transition it into the spring season. Really going to elevate a lot of your outfits. You can wear it over top of leggings or with jeans or really dress it up with a skirt and a sweater dress and a cute pair of boots. It has pockets at the front and then two kind of button closures which i actually can find on this one so i do like that i think it looks really cute from the back and if i'm not mistaken i think it might come in a couple of other colors and then we have what i would say is a classic faux fur coat option this one is from h m it's very different than the previous two i shared with you they're more in a teddy style material I mean, they're just different. They definitely give off a different look and feel. This one I think could be elevated and dressed up, but it's really all about how you style them. Now I'm looking at this jacket in the viewfinder and what I'm thinking is, although I really love brown and it's super popular for this season, it's really challenging me. I've been so intimidated by brown for so long, like wearing it, I've always gone for black. And so I'm really trying to incorporate it into my wardrobe this season, but this one, I think I would like it if it was more of a chocolate brown and it's kind of giving off like gray brown vibes. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm gonna leave that right there. Anyways, it's also a little bit more relaxed than the previous one I shared with you from Abercrombie. I feel like I like the structure look of this one just a little bit more for my personal style. This one is just a little bit kind of like loose through the waist area and I don't really know if it does a lot. However, what I do think it does well with is being layered underneath because it has a lot of space. This is an extra small. It's kind of like wearing a nice cozy bathrobe, but you know, in an elegant, tasteful way. Let me know what you're kind of leaning towards. I have one more I'm gonna share with you and then we're gonna move into some footwear. Now I wouldn't wear this next coat over top of the sweater dress that I'm wearing right now. I don't think they really go together, but I have to say I do actually really, really like this faux fur teddy coat from Abercrombie. It's actually the same material as this one. It's just in kind of more of an off-white cream color. I know for a fact that this particular one comes in kind of like a very kind of light tan beige color. Insert a photo up on the screen. This one is definitely more of a long line jacket, so it comes to about mid calf on me, which you'll see in the try on clip. It has that kind of structured collar, which I like. It's lined. It has really nice kind of like deep pockets at the front. I think it looks high end and luxurious. Abercrombie's actually done a really good job. And I mean, if you take care of this one, you should definitely have it for future fall and winter seasons to come. I mean, for a ski holiday, for going out for a date night, or kind of like any festive activities you're getting up to around the holidays, even into February, around Valentine's Day. I think that this is such a beautiful option. I've been a huge fan of H&M footwear for several years now. I've shared so many different pairs of shoes from H&M here on my channel. So I have a couple of really gorgeous boot options to share with you. I'm always really impressed with the quality and also the price. These, I believe, are a dupe of the Prada boots, if I'm not mistaken, and UGG actually has a similar option. So I feel like you can get the look for a lot less with this pair from H&M. You could go mid-tier with UGG, or you could splurge on the luxurious version from Prada, but these are super cute. These like puffer, kind of quilted style boots, very much on trend for this season. These have a really nice thick rubber sole, so I think that they're gonna be comfortable and also kind of keep you safe when you're walking out Side. I don't imagine that you'll be falling or slipping in the snow by any means. They're gonna keep your feet nice and insulated. They're super cozy on the inside. And then they have this adjustable toggle here at the front. 
I'm not 100% sure if these come in another color. If they are, I will let you know. Now, the next pair to share with you are slightly different, and I do actually think I prefer them more, and I'll tell you why. These, as you can see, are a little bit open here at the front. It's all about how you wear them and how you style them. I probably would go for a higher sock, like over top of a legging with these, just because I wouldn't want that kind of top part of my ankle at the front exposed. I really do not like the cold, so that's me, but let me share the next pair with you. So these would actually be my pick for a couple of different reasons. So the first one being, you can see that they come up higher at the front here. They have that zip closure, which I really like, and I just think they're gonna keep kind of the top part of your ankle really, really insulated and warm, and that's you know something I appreciate during the winter season. They also have a really nice thick rubber sole, and it actually feels like even more substantial in terms of like grip than the previous pair I shared with you. They even have a little bit more weight to them. So I do think that these are really high quality for the price. I also really like the faux leather kind of trim around it. I think that's a really nice design detail. And to be honest, I almost didn't order these because I was a little bit, you know, intimidated by the color, but I put them on and I'm in love with them. They are absolutely stunning absolutely worth it. I would highly recommend treating yourself or to someone in your family to these boots. They are so freaking beautiful. H&M kind of smashed it out of the park with these. And I think for the price, you're gonna look very stylish this winter season. I'm really excited to be back here on YouTube. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, hit that subscribe button and turn the notification bell on. I promise there's gonna be a lot more videos from me to come and I can't wait to see you back here in the next one. Bye.